right, our dishes today are finished. Inari sushi, when prepared with coarse brown sugar, has a shiny finish. When filled up completely to the corners, the pouches are a particularly attractive sight. When completed, they are soft to the touch. The abaraage with miso and long onion can be grilled at the dinner table. Anything you like can be grilled to a golden brown and enjoyed. Okay then, itadakimasu. Let's eat. Okay, so first I'm going to try the inari sushi. Yeah, go ahead. Mmm. Tasty. <laughs> How is the combination of the abalagi and rice? Mm -hmm. Very delicious. Thank you. Mm -hmm. It is very. It is successful fusion of the abalagi and rice. They are nicely and evenly flavored. Yes, the sesame seed adds great flavor, don't you say? Mm -hmm. It smells mm -hmm. nice. Yeah. It's and it's crunchy. Crunchy. I love the flavor. The rice is nice and fluffy, not too dense, and it's making it easy to eat. Yeah. Try some gari. Ah, gari. <laughs> you change your face. I love gari. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Refreshing and tasty. It's good. Mm-hmm. Good. I try this one. It is a good break yes. between bites of sweet inari sushi. Mmm. <laughs> I love gari. Mm -hmm. Now, Chef, I'm going to eat this. Okay. Uh, you can have anything you like. Uh -huh. So, I'll show you. Okay. I can and then open it. Open it. Open it. The miso. Oh. Miso. I'll just put it a little bit. I'll just put it a little bit. If you like miso, I'll just put it a little bit. If you like anything, you can choose. Okay. Other suggestions are asparagus, smoked salmon, sliced ham. Well, you can use whatever you want. Smokes, I like smokes. Yeah, smokes sounds good. Mm -hmm. Celery. Mm -hmm. Gather the ends together and bind together with the toothpick. So it's chili. Ooh. A shichiri is a type of charcoal stove. It's a Japanese style barbecue. The sizes vary, but there are compact ones like this. The shichirin grills abaraage to a crispy texture, but of course, you can also cook it in a frying pan. Mm -hmm. oh. mm, smells nice. It smells nice? Yeah, the grilled abaraage is starting to smell delicious. Mm. Maybe. Ah, almost done. Yeah. Done? It's okay. It's okay? Okay. Be careful. Very hot. Very hot. You take oh. out at the two stick. Mm. Oh, it's very hard. Very hard. Pari pari. So you know, pari pari gaini. Pari pari. Itadakimasu. Mmm. 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 The abaraage is very different from the one used for the inari sushi. It is nice and crispy. Mm, very cr crispy. Crispy, sure. Crispy inside is very soft. Mm -hmm. Soft the inside. And the vegetable sound is also... And it's steamy and moist in the inside. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Chef, could you give us a comment to finish up today's cooking? Yes. Feel it gently. Oh, today I again learned lots of useful tips and techniques. Thank you, Chef, and see you next time. Bye-bye. Okay, let's review the recipes. For Inari Sushi, roll chopsticks on the abarage to incorporate air inside, and then cut in half. Blanch in hot water for a minute to wash off some of the oil. Drain in a sieve, let it cool, and dry the excess water and oil with paper towels. For simmering the abaraage, take dashi, mirin, coarse sugar, 
and soy sauce and heat until combined. Add the abarage, cover with a drop lid, and gently simmer for 10 to 15 minutes over low heat. There's one more step for the abarage. Baste it with the simmering liquid from time to time. Lay the abarage on a tray and let them cool. Combine the washed rice and water and cook. For the rice seasoning, first take the vinegar, sugar, and salt and dissolve together over heat. Then cool. Transfer the cooked rice to a wooden tub. Pour the vinegar mixture on top and mix with a cutting motion. Distribute the vinegar mixture evenly to every single rice grain. Fan from time to time and cover with a damp cloth to let the grains absorb the vinegar. Then mix in the sesame seeds. Add the simmering liquid from the abarage and mix. Place the rice in the abarage pouch to fill them about one third of the way. Make sure every corner is stuffed with rice. Add some rice so that almost half of the abarage is filled with the rice. Close the pouch and it's done. Enjoy a variation of flipping the abarage inside out and then stuffing it. Decorate with shiso leaves and gari and you're finished. The next dish is the grilled abarage with miso and onion. Cut the carrot, celery, cheese to approximately the same size. The onion should be thinly cut and the same length as the other ingredients. At the table, smear the inside of the abarage with miso. Stuff with the filling and grill over the shichirin stove. Stuffed dishes are both fun and easy to make and eat. Enjoy.